I'm going to Denmark in exactly three days from right now. I'm so excited to get out of this monsoon season. I love looking at rain and listening to rain and watching thunderstorms, which there is literally a thunderstorm right now. But not when I have to go outside and run errands, but we're gonna get, we're gonna get a cozy vibe out of it today. I have so many things I need to plan before I take off. Like for example, I'm going to my wax appointment. I figured I want it to be smooth for European summer. Then I'm having some lunch and cakes and coffee with Erna. I haven't seen Erna since she gave birth and became a mother. So that's a big thing. I'm really excited to see her. Then I'm getting my nails done and my toes. And then I'm gonna have dinner with Stephanie. So it's a really jam-packed day. I am just excited to go out and cross some things off my to-do list so that will make my Virgo energy a little bit more calm. <sighs> this is the outfit of today. I'm wearing a little bolero from the open product that arrived yesterday. My Jerf Avenue top. I'm wearing nipple covers for the first time and I hope I'm not gonna get too sweaty underneath it. And then a little mini skirt from Jerf. I was thinking to wear my under the knee boots, so that's the plan. Let's head out. This is no joke. I don't think I've seen this much rain before here. I guess I just gotta get out in it. myself um, you have to always go and just wash yourself first wait at that and uh, now I'm ready to get up on the bed squeezing this one real tight because it's gonna be so fucking painful thankfully I brought my earpods this time so I can listen to a podcast or something that will distract me see you on the other side Hello from the sunny next day. I'm here to quickly interrupt you to tell you a little bit about the sponsor of today, which is Skillshare. I've mentioned last week that I had a really rough time in quarantine, but one thing that did make it a little bit better for me was be able to use my time productively with Skillshare. I'm so lucky to have gotten the opportunity to share Skillshare with you multiple times now, but if you still don't know, Skillshare is an online learning community where there is seemingly an endless amount of classes available for you to take. Because I was feeling a little bit depressed in quarantine, I decided to take some classes that made me feel a little bit better mentally. Like for example, the Law of Attraction 3-3, Achieve Any Three Goals Using This Three-Step Creative Visualization Process by Kristen Becker. This class really helped me identify my priorities in life, which kind of got me burning that fire again. I also took the Affirmations, Meditation, Breathwork and Yoga class for Cultivating Inner Peace by Peace Inside Me. This class really made me feel so much better, both physically and mentally. I truly, really couldn't recommend Skillshare enough, so as a little treat for you, the first thousand people to click the link in the description box below will get one month free trial off of Skillshare. Now let's get back to yesterday's insanely rainy but wholesome day. <laughs> Waxing is successfully done now. That was like so much more painful than I feel like it usually is, I don't know why. <sighs> I'm gonna head out to see Erna now, but first I really want to find a gift for her since I haven't seen her since she gave birth. Um, I have a feeling like most people give people like the, like the baby some gifts, but I kind of want to go to Lush and see if I can find some self-care items for Erna. She must be exhausted, so that's the plan. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, that looks so bad. good. <laughs> okay. You can order like, like two and then yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh my god, this rain is out of this world. It's so insanely crazy, guys. Hence why I am always traveling in July. Oh. But now I'm on my way to get my um, nails done. I'm getting extensions on my nails, on my hands, for it to get a little length and a little sexiness. And then I'm just gonna put on some gel on my feet. <sighs> Let's go. Fuck, I walked into a tree. <laughs> Shit. This is gonna be before. <laughs> my nails are so short. Let's do this. Hey, baby. Mm. Yeah. What? Why? What's up? I'm so happy. I'm really glad that it's not too long because I'm not used to length, you know, so it'll kind of like be weird. It's great. <coughs> so suspicious that we keep coughing. <laughs> yeah. Are we good now? <laughs> I, actually, I tested negative again two days ago. You, you tested negative? Again, yeah. I didn't even try to test myself because I knew like it Someone can show what that could take up to eight weeks yeah yeah we're, <laughs> we're we were we were the covid bodies because the COVID bodies. <laughs> oh. you know we went out friday two weeks ago yeah and so because we both got it we're pretty sure that was when we got sick yeah but the other people who went with us they didn't get sick we were just unlucky i guess i i really think so and we never had it so yeah it sucks. I do not recommend it. <laughs> do not recommend, no. Oh my god. But we're going for dinner and some wine. We need some wine. I need wine. <laughs> Let's go, the COVID team. <laughs> now we're in this camera. <laughs> Stephanie is trying to out Gen Z me right now and she's doing well on it. <laughs> Backstreet Boys were popular back in the day. Back in your day! <laughs> yeah, like Nick Carter all the way. Because, like, I kind of assumed that the Backstreet Boys was just a little bit too old for you. I was, like, right on the... I was a little bit young. Okay, but we're young fans. I was, fans. like, right on the... I was, like, young. But Nick Carter... See, I don't even know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> I was a One Direction fan. <laughs> oh my god. This is fancy. You wanna hear something crazy? Yes. I've never in my life had mac and cheese before. Really? Yeah. We clearly never lived in America. <laughs> no, I did not live in America. <laughs> Yeah? That's it's huge! huge. <laughs> 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 
Sheer silk cush cushion. Are you kidding me? I just bought two cushions today. <laughs> you can return them. <laughs> Maybe they caught on to the fact that I'm going to Europe. that's <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, it's Saturday and I am flying to Denmark tonight, but I am literally, I'm so goddamn tired. I We came home I think at like 2 a.m. and then I had forgotten to wash the clothing and all of that, so I had to do that twice, so I ended up sleeping at 5 a.m. So I have a couple of things that I have to do today so i'm writing a little list to keep like an an overview i also have to just clean the house a little bit because jake's parents are coming over tonight um before i'm heading out it's jake's mom's birthday today so we're gonna celebrate her a little bit before heading out so i need to clean a bit as well now let's uh, take my bike and head out i really want to stop by um behind our building to check on the kitties um, in my last video, we said that Jake had found some kitties and the mom looked really skinny, so we've been buying them cat food, even though the Kyungbyajashi, the guy who like manages the buildings, he says to not feed them so that they'll find another place to be, but I don't want to listen to him. <laughs> Let's see if we can find them. Look, there's one leaning in here, down an inch of sniffing. I'm kind of worried because this is a different kitty. This is like a... The other ones that Jake found was um, orange. Oh look, it's looking at me now. The other kitty family is in here. My love Never had a When she finally slips away, she left me bound. I crept inside to the mansion banister, drunk her in a forest fire on a lonely Father's Day. We can be bad and good. Together, we can love each other loud. I'm lighter than a feather. I'll hide and yes, if someone asks, I do need two suitcases for a month. <laughs> Um, back from dinner with Jake's parents and they're out having a coffee now they'll be back here in maybe 40 minutes time so I thought I would like try to pack for a full month in 40 minutes I'm not sure I don't know about you but I'm the kind of person who always packs the last minute I usually don't end up forgetting anything I think I'm very good under pressure and I'm also very organized so it's easy for me to get the things I need.
with my sweetheart.